And that's the thing, right? Being a Maple Story refugee, any RNG in Lost Ark is just child's play. Hey guys, it's definitely no secret that there's a ton of RNG in Lost Ark. There's RNG when it comes to honing, there's RNG when it comes to changing your gems, your elixirs, transcendence, heck, there's even RNG when you're in Chaos Dungeon and, you know, trying to see if you can get a Fade Ember, and when it drops, the RNG of what it's gonna be, right? Basically, RNG runs deep through the game. And I had a viewer come in last night talking about how they originally quit Lost Ark because of how much RNG there was in the game, and we got in a little bit of a discussion with the chat talking about things like, well, is it just a Lost Ark thing, or is it just a general MMO or a general game thing? And like, is it too much RNG, or is it just because the RNG is so focused around things that you upgrade, right? We had this whole discussion on stream, and I think it was pretty interesting, so I wanted to share that with you guys today. As always, I stream every single night on twitch.tv slash miselexshiru, so we have all these discussions every single night. If you guys want to join in, please come watch the stream. But if not, hopefully I'll see you guys on the next video and I hope you enjoy this one. Name an animal that's not RNG based. I mean, it's not that it's not RNG based, but like there's so much RNG in this MMO compared to like, I don't know. Like I've never played WoW before, but I feel like Western MMOs are probably a little bit better about like not having everything super RNG based, right? Kind of want to say Guild Wars 2 is an RNG based? Probably, I don't know, maybe. I, I never really played in deep into Guild Wars 2. The problem with me is the only MMOs that I've played have always been Korean MMOs. I've never played a non-Korean MMO to the end game. Uh, maybe RuneScape? I don't know. Maybe RuneScape? A little bit less RNG based? 50k hours in is a RuneScape has more RNG than Lost Ark? What aspects of it is RNG? How am I RNG whenever everything is RNG to power your character and all you need is to be perfect? There's less chance to be gatekept. This is my first MMO so I don't know what others like. Yeah, sadly for me, I've only played Korean MMOs to the end game. 3k hours getting this bow and didn't get an OSRS. Can you buy it? Can you buy the bow? I'd assume you can buy it, right? Yeah, you can. Was it an Iron Man account? I mean, there you go. It was an Iron Man account, right? But on normal, you can buy it. So you can part you can go away for you can you can not have that uh RNG aspect to it. And that's the thing, right? Regardless of what you do in this game, anything that you can buy, it's still gonna be RNG, right? Like, pretty much anything that re relates to power level is RNG. Whereas in some other games, you can buy a lot of the things. Like, if you don't want an RNG for, like, an upgrade or something like that, you can just buy it. You can just farm the gold and buy it. You can say you can farm the gold and get to pity, but at the end of the day, like, you know, there is that RNG factor to it still, right? Whereas in another game, you can just buy it out flat out and not have to even worry about RNG. So the RNG to get the funds or the buy well, Not really. I mean, there's RNG to get it faster, right? But at the end of the day, you're still there's still kind of like some ways to really reliably to get gold. Like with any game, right? Any game with an economy, there's going to be certain ways to like RNG certain things faster. But there are games that have more and less RNG. And I do think that Lost Ark does have quite a bit of RNG compared to a lot of other games. I think it's rather than like having a game with no RNG, it's just like it's like what he says, right? What's like what Tip Pants says? It's the far part that the direct action of upgrading your character is so RNG. It's not that having a game with RNG is bad or like an unentertaining for them. It's just that the action of actually upgrading your gear is all RNG. Whereas in other games, like you can just buy the gear flat out, right? You can go to the auction house and buy that piece of gear you want. Maybe the getting the gold part, there might be some RNG there. But the thing is, the feeling is a lot better in many ways. When the gold getting is RNG versus like, you know, an actual upgrade is RNG. It's like a it's like a feeling thing. Like at the end of the day, all with all pretty much any game like that's uh has an economy is gonna have some form of rng in my opinion right whether it's like you know path of exile whether it's like new world whatever anytime there's an economy in the game there's gonna be certain things that are worth more than others because of their rarity how hard it is to get things like that but it's like where that rng lies is probably the difference between somebody liking the game versus somebody not liking the game RNG is better than getting your lines broken and failing though. For far. Yeah, no, that, 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 like Maple Story, when you freaking star your equipment and having that shit break on you, oh boy. 
Woo! You spent all this gold, all this time farming shit up, and then you just get your gear broken. That's the worst right there. And that's the thing, right? Being a Maple Story refugee, any RNG in Lost Ark is just child's play. Because at the end of the day, for the most part, a lot of things have pity. Well, not a lot of things, but holding has pity. And then um, you can't break your gear, right? You can't break your gear. And that in itself is a godsend. 22 or boom. Yeah. I think it's just like, I feel like I always say this, and maybe this is the case with other games as well. I don't know. But like, I feel like people who have grinded through Maple Story for years are like battle hardened veterans. Because there's so much bullshit in that game that doesn't exist in other games that Maple Story players just put up with. It's crazy. Child Slay, sus, ain't no way. They may as well wear whales and throw money at the problem and bypass the RNG. I mean, ish, right? You're not bypassing the RNG per se. You just, at that point, don't care about the RNG anymore. There still is RNG, because you can still hold and get the, the hold like super early. Because like even whales, right? I don't think they want to have to spend that much money on a hold. It's like they're willing to spend it, but if you ask a whale, hey, would you rather spend $10 on a hold? versus a hundred dollars in hone i'm sure they'd still say i'd prefer to get the ten dollars it's like if it takes a hundred dollars fine i don't care but i definitely prefer the ten dollars right 